how do we feel about the Rockets rebuild? Will, on a scale of one to 10, how confident are you in this Rockets group? Yeah, I love just the the fact that the the ten is just getting back to the postseason where you could be like the ten seed and making it to the playoffs. And hey, this man. Where we, playoffs, so we, playoffs. <laughs> let's go for the ten seed, everybody. Let's open. Let's sh- let's shoot for the stars. Do you know the amount uh, of improvement they would have to have to get close to the ten seed right now? Uh, that's a fact. Because like, I, I would just literally watch, like twenty games though. <laughs> yeah, I just watched two Rockets games in a row, and it Ooh, was that rough. is rough. That it is rough. Was rough. Uh, but yeah, I'm I'm gonna give it a four just because only reason I give it that much is because I like Jalen Green. I feel like mm-hmm. they hit on the Jalen Green pick. He's gonna He's be good. good. But I hate everything about what they're doing in Houston. Just the way they just have a team full of like a it's just like an AAU team. It's a bunch of young dudes. They out there doing whatever. Shingoon's just throwing up random shots. I don't know what they're doing with Steven Silas at that front. I, they they're like convinced James Harden is coming back to save the day. A whole a bunch of them down thing, there. Man. That's a weird it's just, thing. It's so weird what they got going on in Houston. I don't like anything they're doing. And and if when Benyana goes there, I, I would be really depressed because I, I feel like I just want him to go somewhere <laughs> with more organizational, just a direction. Of, like we know what we're doing. We know where we're going. Yeah. And if he goes there, it'll just be like. Just take 25 shots, Wimby, and we'll, we'll see what we can do next year. Marcus, scale of 1 to 10, how do you feel about the Rockets' rebuild? Eight. Whoa! Wow. You, you got I, – I can't believe you're missing the epicness of this tank here. Like, this is this is choreographed chaos that's happening. You are so sleep on what's going down in Houston right now. Mm. Look, if they get Wimby Yama and, like, a veteran on the team somewhere, maybe oh, somebody over 25, a guy with a beard. It, even if, yeah, I'm just saying like, think about that. They are, they've gotten so James bad. Hard, James Harden cannot James, be your veteran president. No, he cannot. <laughs> no. He cannot. Especially not in Houston, right? No. Not in the like, no, I'm going to show y'all. And boy, he'd I'll be like, y'all don't know way. about the old spots. Let me take you to the old. Tell you. And Wimby can't hide in any of these spots. If you see nah. a big 7-4 dude walk Mm-mm. in the Mm-mm. spot, you're going to notice him. They are like they're in play for the biggest like draft prospect in 50 years. Right. They are uh, uh, like, of uh, like if you're a veteran NBA player and need a, like a revival, mm-hmm. like Houston is perfect for you. Like you're going to get the ball. You're going to get leadership yeah. roles. Like you just uh, asked John wall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Not mm. not I, I'm saying it like you still good. You just oh, you play, like not um, like don't do that. I've been gone for two wow. years. John Wall. Wow. John Wall's good. Nah, he was great on Theo hey, He podcast. better than Justin okay. Patton, all right? I'm just saying, like, he was There's a little the, further down the, the road than what I'm the, talking we about. Found the line of demarcation. Are you yeah, better right, than yeah. Justin Patton? <laughs> He's a little bit further down the road than I'm talking about. I'm talking about you know yeah. 30, mm-hmm. right? Yeah, like, like an Eric Gordon. No, it's too far down the road. <laughs> <laughs> too, too far down the road. I just feel like they're they're like in position for somebody to come and say, "Yo, I could make something out of you." Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I can, I could do something with you. Uh, yeah, and I, and when I, it come to uh, when it come to Texas and Florida, we always gotta throw the taxes into into the mm-hmm. discussion. Yeah, these dudes making thirty million a year. You go to one of these states where they ain't taking all your money. It plays a factor. We yeah, that that does. That. yeah. Well, you know, they throw a bunch of money at Jalen Brown. Yeah. I'm just saying. Maybe, maybe. Him and James Harden? No, him and Wimby, though. No. No, no, no. You can't do that. 